Hey everybody, hello and good morning. Greetings once again. We are located here in Plymouth, Wisconsin. We're about 13 miles to uh, that little mobile station in by Menards and Sheboygan. Uh, let's see. I only got one camera working today. Val Chavez, I already have that uh, AZ-1 cover. That's never been a problem for me. I will try to explain that a little later to what I'm... what I'm having problems with as far as the, uh, the cover. I have all the uh, waterproofing cover for the cameras that I bought. Unfortunately, they don't offer a hole for uh, the HDMI cables to go through. I don't know if this compass came with the phone or AJ installed that app on my phone. AJ is my IT when it comes to my phone. When I, my phone goes cuckoo, I go, AJ! got good news and got some bad news. Good news is <coughs> my wife has uh, agreed to let me buy uh, the cameras, a camera, but I think she wants me to wait until uh, that Black Friday, the uh, internet Black Friday kind of a thing shopping so and that's like what November 23rd or something like that 30th I don't know uh, it's gonna be a little while before I can get all these equipment put together again oh please please bear with me until I can uh, I can get all these put together I know a lot of you out there have enjoyed the multi-view cameras and I will try to get them as, uh, running as soon as I can I've got a couple of ideas that I want to add on to my videos but I don't know it, it's just financing financially right now I am just I'm scrapped don't worry I'm not I'm not asking anybody to donate anything or I'm not I'm not gonna stop you either <laughs> I'm just trying to convey to you to what's going on especially for uh, Val Chavez Val I got the packages at the house uh, I have yet to go and do an opening video on that mail call check out baby blues reflection see it Pretty neat, right?
So, what am I gonna do today? I don't know. There are certain projects that I've been putting off for months and months now, and it's weighing me down. I really gotta get that thing done. One of the things that I probably will end up doing today is uh, cutting the grass, cleaning the leaves, and that probably means I'm gonna have to bring my uh, backpack uh, air blower with me. This thing happened this morning. See, Mama always takes AJ to schools around 6.30. So by about 6.35 to 6.40, they usually call me and give me my daily do dose of good morning medicine. I don't know why, uh, nobody called. No voicemail, no messages, nothing. So I don't know if AJ went to school today or not. By the way, AJ is a freshman. She is 14 years old. Jackie, I think Jackie's turning no, she just turned 20, 20 years old. And as I think I mentioned this last night, my wife works at the Rocky Knoll nursing home in Plymouth, Wisconsin. I don't know why, but my wife has this condition maybe you guys can help she has this condition that where her feet always hurts you know how when you sit on a toilet too long and your blood circulation is uh, you cut off the blood circulation on your feet and then when you stand up there's a feeling of a thousand needles poking your feet. Uh, that's what she describes. And it's every day. She feels like that every day. And she recently went to the doctor for it, but I don't know, they can't seem to, they can't seem to get it. In spite of all that pain, she works and picks up a lot of overtime. Jackie is a, uh, she's a lifeguard. Well, I don't know, yeah. What she does is she teaches small kids how to swim. Well, she's a swimming instructor, I suppose. I miss my camera outside. I really do. If 
feel like I'm having a little symptom withdrawal. <laughs> This used to be the old, uh, where the old Minarge was. Now they moved over there. Did you guys know that it's a Wisconsin state law that uh, you, there can only be one vehicle at a time when a truck is on a turnabout? For example, like what I did, um, four-wheelers or any other vehicle can't be beside me, he had, had to be like 40 feet behind a big truck, and which is a really, really good law because most four-wheelers just don't know. I, I guess since ever since this uh, turnabout has been popular here in Wisconsin, there's been a lot of uh, accidents. I wonder if you need a CDL for that little compactor. No, 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 he's, he's making a left turn. Yeah, I need a CDL for that. <laughs> you know what, I'm gonna go this way. here. Well, we'll catch you guys a little later. I don't know what, when, and all that stuff, what's gonna happen today. So, God willing, we'll see each other later.
Peace.